Welcome back to the Legendary Encounters Matrix. All right, let's begin. We're gonna have two turns Neo, tur two turns Morpheus. Neo's in the real world at the moment, and he now has his new avatar out as well. So that is pretty cool. All right, so for his hand, yeah, we're gonna take a look here quickly, and then we're gonna add a card to the Matrix. So we've got two, three, four, recruit. Morpheus, I looked, has no uh, coordinate cards, so that's not great. And there we go. We have four in the matrix, and we're going to figure out what we want to do with Neo. Okay, so we have five recruit for Neo. He's in the real world, so with two, three, we have no synergies for this one. With our five recruit, we are going to go ahead and get three. We're going to get the tank card operator. Once this turn, you may move a player to the real world to recruit. That's a pretty good card, I think. Immediately replace, he has two recruit left, and we have Kung Fu. Oh, we have a tank coordinate four. All right, <clears throat> for two, his remaining two recruit, he'll get I know Kung Fu, because why wouldn't we? It's a cool card. We'll get that one. And it gets replaced. We need to have someone with six. And we have, I think, your bug. Ooh, this is a good one to get for somebody to get rid of the bug that Neo has in him. All right, he has a free move to the Matrix if he wants to go. He'll have two attack. We might as well go into the Matrix, living dangerously. With our two attack, we will scan the streets. And in the streets, we have... Um, you're faster than this enemy. Training. Okay, fight. Discard the top card of the strike deck if it has two damage or more. Defeat this enemy, otherwise leave it where it is. <coughs> hmm. And it costs you three to attack it. Uh, and it might just stay there. Oh dear. All right, well, mm, we don't have three attack to do that. And I guess the training of Neo, we can do this with Morpheus as well. All right, discarding our cards. Drawing up six new ones. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, coordinate attack. Cool. Gonna shuffle the discard. All right, shuffled up the discard, and the next card is going to be an unplug. All right, so uh, no synergies. He does have green fist coordinate. He could use, whoops, for Morpheus. Otherwise, he's got two, three attack, and he, he has his free your mind card. All right, that's gonna be his hand for next turn. Let's go now over to Morpheus and see what he's up to. All right, card to the Matrix. Of course, every start of every turn. Um, and let's see what we get. So, uh, that's it. Over to Morpheus we go. And, um, okay, he is in the real world. And he could make that a three recruit for five. Oh, we don't have six recruit, but he does have this one. Uh, do we want to have... We don't have to have Neo coordinate the two attack yet. If we don't want to. So I think we're going to use the switch card for three recruit. So that'll give him four, five recruit. So Morpheus has five recruit. He's going to get the bug card. Because we do know that uh, Neo has a bug in him. So we're going to go for three. He's going to recruit the bug card. Replaced with... Another tank, Operator 3, and then, yes, for his remaining two recruit, he'll get also a Kung Fu card. Why not? Replaced with Welcome to the Real World. All right, now he has a choice. He can go into the Matrix. He'll have one, two, three attack. Uh, so, yeah, we'll go into the Matrix. And so three attack. Fight, discard the top card. Of the strike deck, if it's two damage or more, defeat this enemy. Otherwise, leave it where it is. This one gives you strikes. It's enemy training. There must be some training stuff that's supposed to happen. Now, we could go ahead and do that, or we could scan somewhere else for three attack. Or five, if Neo coordinates his two attack. Actually, two attack, green fist, but there's no... No synergies there, or does Neo want to keep the two for himself? I think Neo's going to keep the two for himself. Okay, we're going to try to defeat this enemy. So three attack, we have to look at the top card of the strike deck and hope that it's two damage or more. It's one. Ugh! Well, it stays there. That sucks. Okay, so it stays there, and that's the end of Morpheus' turn. So he's going to 
discard all his cards and drop six new ones. One, two, three. And he also has five, so I have to shuffle his discard. Ooh, lots of good looking stuff. So I'm going to shuffle his discard. All right, we shuffle his discard, and his next one is going to be, ooh, one of the bonus cards. So it looks like Morpheus is next turn. He's got his Freer Mind. Two, three, four, five attack. Six attack. He's got lots of attack. And if he defeats an enemy, he gets to draw an extra card, which I need to remember because I do forget that sometimes. All right, that was Morpheus's turn. They're both in the Matrix. Over we go now. Back to Neo. Oh dear. All right, well, this card comes right into the combat zone. It is an enemy that's going to give him strikes, I guess. Um, even though it says it's enemy training. All right, Neo, what can you do? We didn't have a coordinate, I don't think. So he's got three. He's got his freer mind, which is pretty cool. So for the freer mind, we're in Act 2. Now oh, that's why it's going to work. You get three attack and draw a card. So he gets to draw a card and he gets three attacks so he basically now has three four five six he has seven attack <laughs> and two two three four recruit well let's see if we can defeat this enemy because it's going to give him strike so that's going to cost three of his seven attack and this has to be a two damage or more and it's two yes all right which means this enemy i believe is now defeated Discard top card of the strike if it has two or more damage, defeat the enemy, otherwise they, okay, boom, defeated, you're out of here, um, defeated enemies, I believe it goes into defeated enemies, it says enemy training, again, I'm not really sure, so he's defeated an enemy training, I think that's probably going to make a difference, so he has seven attack, that was three, he's got four attack left, well, for four attack, let's do the two here, and, ah, uh, no one's ever made the first time, Reveal, put this above the building space. Oh dear, okay. Um, while in the matrix, if the building space is clear, you may jump. Discard the top card of your deck. If it has a cost five or more, you made it. Otherwise, draw a strike. Either way, complete this challenge. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. Oh, and it's a training too. Ay, yi yeah, yeah. Alright, I'm going to have to rearrange some stuff. Put that over there. And this is the building challenge. Okay, well, at least it frees this up. That is pretty cool. We still have a two attack remaining. So we're going to might as well scan the streets. We had seven, so three, four, five. Yep, this is six, seven. And it's see the Oracle. Reveal, put this in operations. Act two, if seven training cards have been defeated, you may talk to the Oracle. Complete this challenge and begin act two, part two. Know thyself. Okay, so that's what the training is all about. So we've defeated one already. Uh, and I do have an eight-sided die here, so we're going to use this to keep track of how many training missions we have completed. And that, now, now we have a free line, a hard line to the real world. So Neo will come to the real world, and he has, how many recruit did he have? Two, three, four recruit. Uh, he's got four recruit, and yeah, we're going to go with another uh, tank coordinate to attack four recruit and that will be the end of Neil's turn so we're going to replace the card oh, if I can get it off the top of the deck with another one of the extra cards guns lots of guns all right two plus and drop six new cards for his next hand he did not have uh, nope okay just wanted to double check that he didn't have the trinity card one two three four five and six his next hand. So Neo's next hand, he's in the real world now, is I know Kung Fu. An attack, an attack. Bug! When you draw this, discard it. Okay, well that's in his discard pile now. So now he only has five cards. Three attack. Oh wow. Very basic. Uh, very, very basic hand. Not the greatest. Okay, that is Neo's turn up last for episode today. We're going to end off with Morpheus. Okay, Morpheus's turn, and yes, everything moves along. All right. God, you have to pull a five-plus card from your top of your deck to do this? That's crazy, right? Um, the building spaces. Oh, if it's clear, you could jump. Discard the top card of your deck. If it's five or more, you made it. Oh, my God. Otherwise, you take a strike. That is brutal. That's absolutely brutal. I'm sorry. That one is beyond nasty. All right, he has a free hard line to the real world, so that's all good. He has 
Uh, wow, no synergies with anything because he's got all three different symbols. That one triggers off a green fist, which he doesn't have. This one triggers off that, which he doesn't have another card. Uh, two, three. So he's got two attack. And this one is off of this one. So he's got four different symbols, no synergies. I'm not building a good deck for Morpheus, am I? Okay, two, four, five. He has six attack. Six attack, and it looks... Well, he has his... Um, Resolve your avatar's ability. Okay, so his avatar's ability and act two is he gets three recruit and draw a card. All right, so he gets three extra recruit, draw a card. Ooh, he's got his, oh wow, he's a ton of recruit. So he's got three, four, five, six, seven, eight recruit. And this time he does have synergies. He may heal a strike from any player. He's gonna heal it from himself. And I'm gonna do that right now before I forget. He had the one strike on himself, so. He's going to heal that, otherwise I will forget. All right, he is in the matrix with a lot of attack. Uh, he's got two, four, five, six attack. Six attack, and i got to remember his extra three recruits. So with six attack, oh dear, should we go? Let's go with the building, I guess. Six attack, look again, enemy training. Reveal if this enemy is in the matrix row, draw a strike. <laughs> Matrix O, at the end of your action phase, turn this face down. Well, guess what? We do have three attack left. Damn it! All right, so we have to draw a strike. So Morpheus just healed a strike from himself, and now, well, he's got to take another one. And he gets, oh man, he's killing him. Yep, he gets pummeled. So Morpheus being pummeled by an agent while he's in the Matrix. I guess he was trying to do something, and the building failed. However, he does have six attack. Two, four, five, six, and with three of it, he will finish this training look again. Three attack, boom. This one, enemy training, done. And that is two training missions completed. And I don't know, it seems odd that Morpheus can do it, but that's the way the game works. Now, what do we have here? Uh, it is now free. If this building space is clear, you may jump. Discard the top card of your deck. If it has a cost of five or more, you made it. Oh man, do we want to risk that? How many cards does Morpheus have that cost five or more? Like, I think one? <laughs> so, I think we're not going to do that for now. We're going to take our free move for the hard line into the real world. And now Morpheus has three, four, five, six, seven recruit. He has seven recruit. And we did defeat an enemy, so he'll get to draw an extra card because it said enemy training. So he defeated an enemy. Extra card, got to remember that too. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, did I say nine recruit? Three, five, six, seven. He has eight. Eight recruit is what he has. All right, eight recruit while for six. Uh, obviously, he's going to get the six coordinate knife attack for six recruit. Replace with a two, and he'll might as well go ahead and grab this two as well uh, for a total of eight. Yeah, so that's his eight recruit. And we get another coordinate for tank card. And that's going to be the end of Morpheus' turn. They're both in the real world now. Uh, we took out some... Just didn't want to do that because not enough high cards. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. I remembered this time. <laughs> wow. And what was the top card? Yeah, it was a zero. So he would have failed and taken another strike. So holy jump, does he have a lot of basic cards? He has a two attack coordinate he could give to Neo next turn for recruit and uh, fighting enemies in the combat zone. He gets plus two with that one. All right, that's gonna be his hand for the next episode. Wow, he took a little bit of a pummel beating there. Neo and, Mate and uh, Morpheus are both now in the real world and here's how we sit. He just didn't want to try that because he was pretty convinced that was not going to happen. So thanks so much for watching along. Thanks for comments, subscriptions, likes. This is Legendary Encounters Matrix. We're playing with Neo. We're playing with Morpheus. We're trying to defeat the game. And oh man, it's going to be difficult. We have two training missions completed of seven to go to the next act. So we can meet the Oracle. Ooh, and that one. Wow, that one is absolutely brutal. I am sorry, that's one of the hardest... I hope that I hope there aren't just seven and we have to do that one because that could be a game ender, I think. Alright, thanks so much. I'll see you next time for the continuation.